What's up guys, welcome to Apex. Thanks for tuning in. Samsung has started rolling out a brand new update for the Samsung Galaxy S23 series. This is the S23 Ultra I've got here, and this has received the June security patch. And this update has arrived on the S23 series before the S24 series. Yes, we have not received the update for June security patch for the Galaxy S24 series yet. My Galaxy S24 Ultra did not receive the update. This may be because Samsung is planning to release the uh, One UI 8 beta for the Galaxy S24 series. Series. Maybe that is the reason for this delay. I'm not very sure, but yeah, we are yet to get the update for the S24 series. And by the time I post this video, maybe uh, we will get the update today evening here in India. So let me keep you posted about that. And we are not very sure whether the S23 series is also eligible to get the beta version of One UI 8. Let's wait and see that. Generally, we see two iterations of phones getting the beta version, the current iteration of uh, phone, which is Galaxy S25 series, and the previous gen phone, which is Galaxy S24 series. But uh, the rumor say that uh, S23 series is also expected to get the beta, but I'm not very sure it might get the stable version of One UI 8. Let's wait and see that. I will anyways keep you guys posted. So be sure to subscribe to the channel to stay updated with everything that's happening with your devices and give this video a like if you find this video informative. Now let's go ahead. Let's go to the settings here. I'll tap on software update and here download and install. As you can see, the change log is much more streamlined now. It's a little different. It only talks about security. The device is protected with improved security. Pretty simple. Since there is no new features or new changes, they have not mentioned anything about that. Usually they say that it there may be some new features, new changes and all that. It is not really needed. Now it is very simple. The device is protected with improved security. So it is a pure security patch. And it also says these changes may vary depending on the model, country or network operator of the customer environment. To get the best from your device, please keep your device up to date and regularly check for software update. Now, a lot of people argue that the software updates are pushed to slow down the device. So they don't even update the device and put their phone at security risk. So I suggest you guys keep your phone up to date. These days, companies don't push these security patches to slow down your device. But yeah, sometimes there will be some issues after you get the update, but that could be due to any other reasons. So be wary of that. So do go ahead and update your device and make sure the phone is safe and secure because you do a lot of online transactions on your browsers or on the banking applications. The phone needs to be protected. There will be a lot of vulnerabilities. Every month you will see new viruses and malwares getting into your phone. So be sure to update your device. Now, let me just scroll down. As you can see, the size is 464.28 MB and the version ends with DYF1 and of course, Android version 15, One UI version 7. Now, many of you guys have been complaining about the battery performance and lags and status on the One UI 7 and this update might fix these issues. So make sure to update this. Let's go ahead and resume download. Once it's downloaded, let's update the device and I'll come back to you and let's uh, do a quick test, a quick uh, app opening test and animation test and let's see if there is any lags or stutters. It's downloaded. Let me install and come back to you guys. All right, now the phone has been updated. Let's open a few applications and let's check the animations and let's see if there is any lags or stutters. This is our usual test after the update. Let's go ahead and do that. Phone application, camera, messages, Play Store, Clock, Gallery. Now let's go to the Recents app. Running smoothly without any issues. Let me just close all of them. Let's open the quick panel, notification panel. Perfect, no issues whatsoever on the Galaxy S23 series. So far, I luckily did not face any major challenges on this device. Even though it's not my daily driver, my wife has been using this phone and there is no complaints from her side about the performance of this phone. Now let's go ahead and check the Google Play system update. You need to make sure that you check the Google Play system update as well after you update your security patch. Let's go to security and privacy and tap on updates. And you can see uh, so far it was April 2025 update that we had. And let's tap on this. Let's see if we have got any latest update for Google Play system. It says restart to update. Now it is not showing me the details of the, re uh, of the update, but let's go ahead and restart this. And let's see if we have got the update for May Google Play system. All right, now the phone has been restarted. Let's go to settings and tap on security and privacy. And here, let's tap on update. Let's see what is the latest update that we have. It still shows April 2025. 
and let's check the update again now. It says your device is up to date. So there is no June Google Play system update yet for the Galaxy S23 series, or not even May update that we have, uh, which we have already received on the S24 series and the S25 series. So if you haven't checked the Google Play system update yet, go ahead and check it and make sure you have the latest Google Play system update as well. Now, this is something which I wanted to share with you guys. Now, I request you guys to let me know how is your device performing, especially the S23 series. How is the battery performance? Is there any other performance issues on the device? Do share it in the comment section. If you own any other device, also share your thoughts about your device in the comment section. And while you do that, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Give this video a like and do not forget to download our wallpaper application wallverse yesterday i have added some amazing uh, wallpapers again every day you get some fresh wallpapers on the application do not forget to download the link is in the description thanks for watching you guys take care and stay safe cheers bye bye